everybody and welcome back. This is Keep It Real. This is episode 6 of Begins Youth. Episode that I actually was looking forward to, but then it actually didn't turn out as exciting as I thought. But it was a good episode. Yeah, it wasn't like, too crazy in terms yeah. of like what the fuck was. Finally something calm. Yeah, it was, it was a calm. Kinda, it was very calm It was episode, calm. Yeah. It was kind of nice just to see the boys. It was <laughs> nice and not. It was nice and not nice as well. Well, there was yeah. still the parent yeah. issues still, still there, issues. but overall. Flashback, flashback number six. Let's go. Um... This time we're starting with Saiyan, he is in the house, he gets a text message from an unknown number saying that you should stay beside your mom for tonight, don't leave her side. But it's an unknown number, he doesn't really get it. His mom wants him to go get her sleeping pills, and so he's gonna step out of the house, which basically tells the mom that there's gasoline outside if you need to like, like cook something or like get the heater going. Yeah. I don't remember what it was with, but it's there if you need it, and the mom's like, okay, be safe, be careful. And Sam basically walks out of the house, still thinking about that text message, and he calls the number, but he doesn't get an answer. Our episode starts with uh, the junior high school members are graduating. Which so is that's Juwan and Haru. Yeah, yeah. and uh, Juwan is sad because uh, he didn't have any family come over because his father's drunk. But actually, he didn't look carefully enough because his sister actually showed up. Yep. Yeah, but she kind of just stayed in the back. Which didn't really make much sense. Why did you even bother why? coming? Yeah, you're gonna if you're hide. not even going to say hi to me. It makes no sense why she hid, but she hid. The funny thing about this moment is that uh, the two graduates were just, you know, together, but you didn't know where the rest of the the rest of the group is. And all of a sudden, you see these dinosaur costume guys come running after them, and they were like, they took a look at like, oh my god! They're coming after us. It was their friends. It was, it's pretty, it was a funny was moment funny. because it, of their reaction. The it's next really scene shows them celebrate, continue with the celebration where they're at a, a restaurant celebrating the, was it Haru? Yes, it's yes. Haru's family. Haru's family treated the rest of the guys out for lunch. Surprisingly, amongst Haru's family, his brother's there. His brother actually came from America for Haru's graduation. They were all playing, uh, and, you know, yeah, so. acting. Like they are a loving family, but they have lots of inner demons. Because as soon as like the, leave, the other six home. leave and they they no one's with them, they immediately turn serious, and you could see Haru being like, "They're treating me like I'm just." It's like a mental abuse. Yeah. Really. Yep. They're just treating him like he's weird and he should not be feeling this way. Well, the next scene happens when uh you know Haru is now at home and uh. He's feeling really guilty about everything that's going on, especially the with the last episode, episode when uh, he pretty much like you know didn't back up that I don't know the guy's name. He didn't back up that 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 other patient that was. The choice. We're, we're yeah. assuming that that's the guy that was being the victim of the earlier incident, and he does the gym and scene. He goes into the bathtub and he submerges his head under the water. That's it. All of these emotions have sort of like been building inside of him, and he overhears his brother complaining along with his mom and dad about him and how oh it's so he's so much work and all that stuff for us to deal with and Haru finally says something to them going I can't help the way that I am he this stands is just up for himself the way I am and you like you have to accept that like it's not going to change and it's your fault that I'm actually still suffering yes. like this and it was really nice and refreshing because for us yeah god the, the hair his family is Horrible to him. Yeah. Next scene is Juan's father is, you know, in the political world, so he's going around campaigning, and it's strong Juan. Like, and Juan. Juan has been dragged along <laughs> with them, going around town, and then the funniest scene for me, anyway, is I don't even get it. They built a stage, and they had uh, all his the campaign them. people dance, and then Juan was part of it. And then it just happened to walk people yeah, coming through and oh no go. Yeah, they came and they I, I was just about to say, wouldn't it be funny if his friends come out and catch him? Boom, they caught him. And well, you know, also with Hostu, because Hostu's like, oh yeah. he's all extra, he's a bubbly. So he starts dancing with them. He joins in. It was it was a funny moment. It was nice too because he made a Juan laugh because Juan was miserable. Next scene is with Sian and he's actually in the burnt um, music school. Trying to, he's looking through a, a map that he, a picture of him, a map that he took of uh, on his phone, and he's crossing things out. It's a mystery. He's still trying to yeah. piece together uh, his mother's past. In the last episode, when the power outage happened, uh, Dogon and Saiyan 
went into the car that was left outside of Dogun's container. But inside the glove compartment, Saiyan was able to magically get a key, open it up, and inside... He found another key. He found another key. But this one had, it was like a house key to some specific place. We don't know what it was. We don't really know. It's a safe key, too. It, it, to me, it sounds like an apartment key. Because I think, it has a number on it. Well, it's like yeah, eight, number eight. So. There's a number eight attached to it. But the whole thing is, is to build on a mystery. Yeah. You're not supposed to find out. The very next scene while Sian is looking at the phone and the map and the key, he gets a text saying, by Juan, saying, by my father's in Seoul. You guys want to come and hang out? Which nope. is cool. You see the, the gang go to Juan's house. They were like... Joking around, enjoying the lavish <laughs> Yeah, lavish place. Place They were like, whoa, this boy is rich. Since uh, Juan invited everyone to the house, he and Saiyan got a chance to talk because a while ago, a couple episodes back, Saiyan actually asked, like, oh, can I come over to your house? Because he was asking about his mom. Juan confirms that he looked through some stuff and he did find out that their mo Saiyan's mom and... His dad did go to the same school together, and they were both in the Scholarship Foundation, but beyond that, he didn't really know anything. They have a heart-to-heart, -heart and... Sian actually told, uh, uh, told Juan. Juan that, he says, you know, I never killed my mother. Everyone, that's a bad No rumor. one's ever killed yeah. her. Yeah, yeah. she no killed one. herself. Yeah. Sian uh, tells Juan about what the principal told him a couple episodes, episodes ago about how his mom accused... Juan's dad of sexually assaulting her, and Juan has, of course, again, never heard of this, but it spurs him to go back into storage and rummage through all of this stuff, and he ends up finding this box with a bunch of, what are those? Cassette tapes. Tape. <laughs> what do you mean? We were all saying, how do you gonna play this cassette tapes? Because there's not many cassette players out there, but then Juan actually started looking at the tapes, and there were actually writings on them. It was like messages. I think this is how Juan's dad and Sian's mom used to communicate with each other. They used to write inside, well, not inside, but on the on road. The on the road. Strip. We don't really know what the notes mean. No one knows. I think the only thing it says is that the relationship between the two of them was very secretive. It was secretive, but I think it was like closer than we think. The final like little bit of notes he says is that his father told Sian's mom that he left something for her in her favorite thing. And we don't know what that is or what he left behind. Building so. more mystery. A little snippet is that Hosu is not taking his uh, narcolepsy pills, but we're not sure why. Another mystery we have to solve probably either in the next couple of episodes. Once again, more mystery building. Like, Anyhow, the, the episode does end with uh, Juan's father winning the election, and all the news reporters are outside his house, and Juan's just standing there, very uncomfortable. It's fun to see them, you know, let loose together again and having a good time. This episode, they they, they had uh, several moments of them interacting together, which is nice because... We had, I, didn't have a lot of that for the past couple Yeah, because don't forget... The past couple episodes was yeah. sad, dark, yeah, dramatic. Kinda, I Once think again, we kind of needed this, honestly. Yes, because don't forget, better together than separate. I think it was another good episode. I enjoyed episode. it. I had fun with, like, there seeing all There has not been the... a bad episode yet. No, it has not. Yeah, I had fun with seeing, like, all the craziness that they were doing again. The dinosaurs were yeah. so random. It definitely makes you want to see more. And yeah. I can't say this, and you, you guys know you've seen most of my, if you guys see most of my TV reviews or my movie reviews, more well, more of my series reviews, I always talk about filler episodes, none so far. Yeah. The fact that they're giving you mysteries from episode one, keep on driving that that mystery that we need to know, we have to find out. I gotta watch the next Every episode. Every time I feel like I've sort of closed some story, you there's another so. one. Yeah, yeah. Yes, there's or another there's another one element to it that gets added. Awesome, and we can't wait until the next one. Thank you everyone for watching today's video. Don't forget to go down below in the comments and tell us what you thought about this episode. While you're there, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that like button. Share it with us, and we will see you guys next time. Have a fantastic day.